What's up everyone, I'm Akta, welcome back on my YouTube channel. In this video we are gonna talk about the dungeon bounty here because I finally unlocked the advanced mode and we are gonna talk about the rewards and the prerequisites in order to get the rewards. Okay, so uh, in order to clear the medium stage here, you need to uh, clear 140 times the guild boss. This is what you are gonna have everywhere here, and then you are gonna unlock some packs. Every time you uh, unlock one, you finish one time this challenge here, you are gonna unlock some packs. But the first packs were interesting maybe, but the last packs <laughs> are super expensive. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. As you can see here, this is the last pack. It's gonna cost 100 euros or dollars in, a, uh, in function of what you what is your currency. Uh, here, 20 Supremes or 20 food. Uh, in order to awaken 5 a hero, you need 11, you need 19 food, sorry, you need 19 food, and so the cost to one awakening 5 hero is gonna be 100 euros. Uh, 20 Supremes otherwise. Uh, this is still interesting if you want a lot of summons for uh, not a lot of spendings. Uh, the only great pack we can have on the game is the Festival 1. It costs 100 euros and you get 12 uh, Supreme Wishes in it, 40 Excellent Wishes and 80 XP Potions. Uh, but it's only on festivals, but it's more interesting to get the others. Uh, or that one maybe It's really expensive though. I mean, I think not a lot of players are gonna buy it. Will you buy it? Do you, what do you think about the price here? I think if the price was halved Because it occurs only one time on your account. You can finish the bounty quest only once and so it could be interesting to have a better promotions on this kind of packs. I mean, half the price, 50 euros for that will be awesome. And th same thing for that aura too. It costs 100 euros <laughs> to get only one aura. And this is the, the Arena Dominator pack. So this aura gives you, uh, if you have a look, I'm gonna show that to you. Uh, this is the one. 40 more speed and the effect is doubled in the arena. So in fact it gives you 80 more speed uh, But it's only to get some stars on this aura because you if you are using this aura You get the same at the end 80 speed in the arena. So this one is equivalent to that one But that one cost way more money uh, just because the rune number 10 is really, really unobtainable. I was lucky enough to get 10 since global launch, but yeah, I don't, I didn't get more than that. So I could craft one of them without buying any aura, any rune, I mean. But yeah, paying, spending 100 euros to get one legendary aura, that one is so freaking expensive. But this is almost the same price today. If we go on the flashbacks here, uh, if you want to buy uh, that aura, this is what it's gonna cost you. 20 euros to get uh, two runes only. This is terrible. So it's gonna cost 100 euros to get 10 rune number 10. And then you are gonna need a rune number four here and number two. So in fact, the total cost is normally something around 140 euros. Uh, and it's, it has been reduced only by 40, so it is gonna cost 100 euro. Never buy that pack. It is so expensive for what it is. So if you are a big whale or a big kraken, maybe it's gonna be interesting, but I would love to have this pack halved. 50 euros to get one legendary aura, one game-changing legendary aura for PvP is gonna be interesting, way more than that. It, as I said, it occurs only one time on your account, uh, so that price is way too much for what it is. Tell me what you think about that in the comment below, and let's talk about the advanced uh, thing here. You get almost the same rewards, but uh, you get twice the Mythic Shards. And uh, you need to clear 200 stages in the Dwarven Ruins. 
I don't know uh, where I am today. Let's check. Let's check it. I cleared uh, the 35, 36 here, 34 here. So a uh, 70, 106, 142, uh, 176. Okay. I'm close to it, 207, 207, so I'm close to it, and so I unlocked everything here. Uh, it's gonna take a lot of time for many players. You need to clear the entire elements of city, st normal stages, so okay, that one. Uh, then you need to clear 270 stages in the faction abyss. 120 floors in the Tower of Mark. Uh, in fact, you need to finish the entire Tower of Mark to unlock that one. And here, 270 stages in the Faction Abyss, I have only cleared 264. And this is where I am. If I push myself, 791 stars. I need to clear 6 more stages in order to unlock it. Um, let's check. So. I'm lacking the three last stages here. If I had Pauline exclusive three, I would be able to clear probably the stage 28 and 29. Sunset stages. I am stuck here for now. Uh, I can't progress through it. Doom Legion. I just have to build some heroes and then I'm going to be able to push some content, but I'm currently building some here. I'm, I need to build Lee's again. And with that team, probably I'm going to be able to clear maybe three or four more stages, maybe five. We are going to see. On the Forgotten, this is where I am. We are lacking some good heroes on the Forgotten at the moment. If I had a storage through the three, yeah, for sure I would be able to clear more content. But this is what I have at the moment and I am stuck with that. I can't tank the attack coming from the bus. But maybe I can clear the 23 though. Uh, on the bro Brotherhood... This is where I am. Four more stages and I have a ton of heroes, but I'm gonna need the new legendary heroes we had recently. Popper and um, Anhijin. Because, uh, yeah, I'm gonna need Han Anhijin. I have enough support in that faction. If I get an Anhijin, probably I'm gonna be able to beat the stage 27 and 28, maybe 29. Because I'm lacking some damage at the moment. Hidden Wave. Yeah, I'm lacking... I'm missing four stages here, but I need Bull. I have all the best heroes in here. I need to build Seth, uh, replace her, put Seth, and replace another one by Bull. If I had Bull in here, uh, I would destroy the boss. Replace a Haley probably or Makin and destroy the boss with that. But I don't have Bull at the moment. With Bull, I would reach maybe stage 28. On the Solar Harbor Guards, um, maybe I can try to push the 28. I need more stats on my heroes. Uh, if I had Donald Rebelly five, star, uh, 5 exclusives here and I'm gonna get him in 4 days, uh, maybe I'm gonna be able to push higher stages here. Maybe beat that one at least. Or I, I should replace him by Barry or Luz. Luz, if I have more exclusives on him, probably I would deal more damage thanks to uh, Rista also. Uh, but maybe just clear the 28 would be great. Foresters, yeah, I'm lacking a lot of stages here, so I can still progress here. I mean, I don't have heroes built. This is what I'm currently building. Uh, with that, if I had one, one, two more exclusives on her, I would be able to push further than that. But it's not the case at the moment. Uh, and I need Teru. If I had Teru, it would be so perfect to push this kind of content. So I'm lacking Teru. Uh, then, Holy Light Parliament. I regressed my Elsa. This is the team I was using before. I, I'm lacking another, uh, another DPS, in fact. To clear waves faster and kill the boss faster. I don't think Burns or other uh, direct damage dealers in here can do something. And I have to build again my Elsa because I regressed her. Uh, so probably I can push uh, stages 24 and 25 if I had another hero. Uh, Eternal Sect, st tw stage 25. Uh, this is the team I am using at the moment. Uh, I think, no, I'm not using Dakota. This is what I used to clear this kind of content. But I'm lacking some stats of my on my heroes. So I'm not able to push further than that. 
And finally, Wizard's Eye, this is where I am. I have the heroes, but it's hard. I'm not doing enough damage with my need rolled uh, to kill the boss fast enough. So this is where I am. And then we have to kill the boss 200 times to clear it. So it's going to take a lot of time. But I need to kill him six, uh, 58 more times. So it's okay. But you get a ton of mythic shards in here. And so this is a really, a really nice. So that was all about the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If it's the case, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Yeah.